surprises most people when they first pass through the glass doors. I think what they expect is a, maybe a clinical area and when they come in here and they get hit with the retail area first, they're amazed. Here patients can find trendy clothes and accessories as well as medical necessities to wage war on cancer. Family and friends can find inspiring t-shirts. I guess this one says, says it all, peace, love, and cure. And children can find a corner to, well, just uh -huh. be a kid. The husbands of the missies requested <laughs> there be an area for a child to set or play. These are the two missies of Missy's Boutique. Both women lost their battle against breast cancer at a young age. Both women asked their families to do something to help cancer patients. One Missy was Judith's daughter-in-law. Judith has been honoring her wish ever since. This is where a lot of tears are shed, a lot of stories are told to me, uh, and a lot of people just need you to listen or give them comfort and give them hope. And so that's what goes on in here. Often a patient's journey begins in the salon. Here, women have their heads carefully shaved to fit stylish wigs. Much care is given to this process. All colors, all colors, you can imagine. So it takes a little bit of time in this room also just to get the right fit and the right color. In the room next door, women are fitted with garments specially designed to meet their medical, physical, and emotional needs, such as camisoles to hold post-operative tubes and bras to fit prosthetics. People that are going through this for the first time, they have no idea. They don't realize that there's even such a thing as a prosthetic, much less a bra with a pocket. Volunteer power, donations, and fundraising events help ensure everyone who wants help gets it. New this year, gift certificates. Judith says it's important for the patients to get an opportunity to shop for themselves and sometimes to buy for others helping them get well. I do feel that when people leave here that they do feel a little bit more comfortable about their journey. And that's my goal. For the